What's up, guys? Oh, hi. We just came back from watching Civil War, Captain America, and initially, uh, it was uh, fantastic. What'd you guys think? It, it was really good. <laughs> it was amazing. Uh, I'm not gonna say it was better than uh, Winter Soldier, but it was better than Winter Soldier. Yeah, it was pretty good. It was very fantastic. Like, for those of you who know the comic books, specifically the Civil War, this is not as uh, grandiose as like the Civil War in the comics, but it does utilize the characters and the story very well. It's basically all about um, actions and the ripple effects and like um, repercussions for those actions, like cause and effect. The thing about this movie that was uh, especially interesting is that I wouldn't really call it a Captain America movie. Like people were saying that it was Avengers 2.5, which I agree with 100%. Mm -hmm. It was barely a Captain America movie. I, I want to say... There's um, like a little bit of a focus on him, I would say, but it was evenly distributed between like all the main characters, really. So Yeah. yeah. Like, I'll, I'll say it was a Captain America movie just to the fact that uh, it was... It began with him and it ended on his story. It wasn't mm -hmm. like an Avengers story where the whole world is at stake. It was like in a Captain America's world. So, like, me, I would have to say it was like a Captain America movie featuring all the uh, Avengers. Um... We'll say we know that Spider-Man and we know Ant-Man were in the movie. Those two characters pretty much stole the show for me because um, in the fight, it was just fantastic. Every every scene that they were in was utilized properly and just, it was fantastic. Yeah, they, they, they just stole the movie. It's... Uh. It's definitely <laughs> awesome. I oh mean, my even goodness. Even like <laughs> Scarlet Witch was really cool. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I would say Black Panther was there. Like, I mean... Mm. Oh, yeah. It wasn't uncool. I wasn't like blown away or anything, but I would see the Black Panther movie. I don't know how much I would love yeah. it. But. I yeah, I completely forgot about Black Panther. His his intro was actually just natural to the story. It wasn't force fed, so that's what I yeah that was about it good. too. So, um, the directors Anthony and uh, the Russo brothers, I should say, uh, have now made two fantastic Captain America movies. They are directing the next Avengers movie, so I am totally like have no problems, like no issues with the next Avengers movie, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be fucking awesome. It's gonna be it's insane. Much, but, it was really yeah. cool. Honestly, they could have even made that movie a lot longer, too. Like, it was very long. Like, it was almost three hours long, but... Yeah, it could have The action, it was so action-packed, really. Like, the type of thing, if you blinked, you would, like, miss something pretty cool, so... Definitely, you know, filled with stuff to look at. <laughs> that are excited about it. Yeah. And at the end, it sets up for the future movies, so... Uh, we gotta keep going with this MCU, though. So, oh rating wise, I I did not see anything wrong with it. Pacing, action, it was. I would just give it a five out of five, ten out of ten, ten stars. Ten America, stars. America stars. It was good. America it was really stars. Good. Yeah. So yeah. So, any closing words? Oh yeah, we have that too. Yeah. And then oh. I'm also so I also have it on me. So. <laughs> so clean. I don't know. Spider Man was. Marissa Tomei as. Uh, uh, Aunt May was fantastic. She's she's, she's I, I like Aunt, Aunt, Aunt May now. <laughs> I love the meme out of that. It's so good. Yeah, <laughs> they they acknowledge it too. That was that was good. So I found Spider Man mildly annoying. That's just my unpopular opinion. Is but it his high voice and his I, boyish I they're, features? They're pushing the like adolescent thing a little hard for me, but doesn't make him a terrible character. It was still a very enjoyable movie. So. Yeah. Right. Um, compared to. Uh, Batman v Superman. Oh my god! Like this one super nerd that was leaving the theater is like, oh, I will tell you all the ways that this was better than Batman v Superman. One way, it was just a better movie, clearly. So, yeah, <laughs> that's simple. That's all that. Best, best, maybe one of the top MCU movies. Like yeah, currently. That, so uh, Winter Soldier was my favorite MCU movie, and this this beat might it. beat it. Yeah, this might beat it. Might beat I need it. to sit on it, but I'll see it again. So I'm but, probably gonna see it again on Tuesday. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so any closing words? I have none. Go see it if you're not already seeing it. So. Mm -hmm. Definitely would recommend. Worth it. Anything else? No. Nope, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> I was just making sure if you actually pressed record because I couldn't see the number. Oh, I the pressed time. record already. Right. It was on my forehead, so. Whatever. Well, All right. goodbye from uh, your favorite trio. Bye. Until next time. Bye. There it is. <laughs> <laughs>